All right, welcome back. We got the Vista Bay Hard Seltzer Tangerine. Uh, two carbs, 5%. This is from State of Brewing out of Wisconsin. You get it from Aldi. This one took the Jackass Challenge and lost. <laughs> Poor fucking Steve-O. With like orange juice. Hmm. Don't smell bad at all. Yeah, but... Don't taste bad at all either. Good orangey flavor. Almost like an orange tang flavor. Yeah, it's a little. The thing about all the Vista Bay uh, seltzers, the flavor is kind of lower than expected. Mm. So. It's my first one. <clears throat> I'll get some other ones. We've got their, uh, we got some from their holiday pack, too. With a spiced uh, cranberry or some shit. I think it's one of them. Hmm. <clears throat> it's funny. I had a few of these already reviewed. And then me and Jesse talked about getting together. And I was like, okay, let me see what I got multiples of compared to what I've already reviewed. There was two, two reviews I've already... Or no, three reviews I trashed because I've already reviewed them. But I had extras I was gonna bring here to review. I'd rather just fucking review with Jesse and suck his nipples later on. So, it works. Getting a little more drunk. <laughs> you wanna know what hit him? And that's why you brought so many beers. Yeah. Oh. <clears throat> <clears throat> I hadn't really drank in months. Really? I've gotten back into it a little bit. I don't think drank more than. One or two beers at a time since before my wreck, almost four months ago. Damn. So yeah, I'm gonna get fucked up tonight. Oh yeah, we never have talked. We haven't talked about your accident. <laughs> so Jesse broke both his arms. Uh, he was wrangling a big old dick. You see, <laughs> it wasn't his. <laughs> All right. So set the scene. What's the weather like? What's the time like? What's the road like? Monday morning, about. Uh, 6.10, maybe 6.15, pitch black. In the morning. Raining, storming, heavy rain. You're going down the highway 62, it's 55 mile an hour, and pretty hilly. And come up over one of the hills, and right as you come over the hill, right there, over the hill, big old like semi dump truck just stopped in the center of the road. Laid on my brakes, but as soon as I came over the hill, it's just right there. Hit the brakes, tried to steer towards the ditch, but it's raining, so truck just kind of goes a little bit sideways, but just keeps going straight, slams into it, totals the truck. I was out for at least a minute. <clears throat> uh, I remember coming to, everything's pitch black because it's dark and raining, and go for the door. I pull up on the latch, but just don't open. I'm like, crap, I gotta get out of this truck, gotta get out of this truck. Try a second time and the door opens up. And come to find out, I guess the problem with me opening the door was I'd fractured my forearm, so that didn't help trying to open the door <laughs> with it. I get the door open, as soon as I step out, there was already a cop right there at my door, like about to open it. He's like, wide as a ghost, like as in he wasn't expecting somebody to crawl out of the truck. It was fucked up. Ended up fracturing this forearm, fracturing this wrist in two places. Tooth almost went through my lower lip, took four stitches, put it back. Bang, bruise all over. Banged up the hip from being on the brake pedal and impact. But yeah, I was just beat up all over. Truck just gone. Demolished. <laughs> Running into a big old like semi dump truck. Hey, that shit don't move. It's like running into a brick wall. Well, tell them what truck you had. Uh, it's a 2022 GMC Sierra 1500 AT4 with the 6.2 liter V8. And what you end up getting? Now I got a 2020 GMC Sierra 2500 HD diesel Denali. Thanks, dump truck. <laughs> Uh, had me out of work now almost four months getting paid yeah yeah 
this next visit I should be getting full release. Wrist healed up pretty quick like they're expecting. Forearm, I guess it was bad enough that it's taking longer to heal up. They were almost about to pull the trigger and do surgery and put a plate in my arm because it wasn't wanting to heal back together. But the last visit, it showed progress, so they held off, and now I've noticed a lot of difference. I don't get much pain in it and everything, so I'm assuming next Wednesday when I go in, they'll release me to go back to work. That's good. But yeah, I had it was a long list of firsts in my life. I had never broke a bone in my body, even playing football and everything else. I had never been in an ambulance, never been put in the hospital, ER, or nothing. I'd never been given anything through an IV before in my life. All that was first in my life. It was, uh, don't recommend it. <laughs> Shit sucks. So what do you think of this? I like that orange flavor. Orangey, tangerine, whatever. Yeah. The bad thing is, it's just, like I said, the flavor is good, but not... Not as high as you expect. Not yeah, as like, strong Like you need you to expect. throw a fucking Cialis in that motherfucker and get that fucking flavor rock hard. You know what I mean? When you first go to taste it, it tastes like it's going to be strong, but it dives off instantly. Yep. Like, my, like my fucking sex drive, god damn it. <laughs> Not sex drive. What is it? Uh, no, no. My sex drive is good. Man. I'm, I'll, I'll, fuck it. I'll fuck a uh, fucking rock hard uh, bucket full of sand if it's good enough. Uh, I'm just saying like duration, you know. 28 minutes is about all I could do. So, I feel bad about it. I, I fucking, I, I go to my, this fucking uh, therapy website and they help me out with that. For some reason, the the lady I'm talking to that's helped me out, she wants to meet up for brunch sometime. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> anyway. Fucking porn star over here. <laughs> <laughs> we just over here. I like it. Um, I'll say eight. It the flavor's great, but just it. Yeah, for what it is, yeah, eight works good. If it had stronger flavor to it, I'd definitely be up there. Yep. All right, so long ass video. We'll be seeing you. Long ass video is in seven. Holy shit! I'm a little 